intra-country uh, trade within ASEAN is an opportunity that is, uh, there's tremendous opportunity there. Uh, but of course, payment becomes an issue. Uh, in Malaysia itself, uh, we categorize the SMEs to a few areas, or a few levels. The first level is uh, even getting them online to start off with. There are a lot of those mom and pop shops that are operating in small villages. They have good products, but they are confined to the traditional boundary of the geographical area within a village, right? So the first thing first is to get them to go online. But to go online is not just, a, uh, it's not about getting them to trade online already. Uh, it's to at least start the marketing, online marketing, right? Get onto Facebook, get into all the different social media to sell their products. Yeah. Then, of course, the delivery comes into the picture, the supply chain and whatnot. And uh, how do you deliver to places that have placed an order, which is 300 kilometers away? And then how do you get the payment done? So all these issues are real for Malaysian SMEs as well, right? And yeah. getting them onto the national uh, online market uh, marketplace is the next level. That Eventually, the utopia for us is the cross-border trade. 